it is a responsible time to invest. Investment on a scale never seen before in this country. But we will continue to live within our means. Investment in long-term projects like roads and rail will not exceed 3% of GDP. But we'll also commit to an additional £150 billion in a new social transformation fund to replace and upgrade and expand our schools, our hospitals, care homes and, yes, council homes once again under the Labour government. Conservatives understand that it's a dynamic free market economy that is the single best way to fund those public services. And if people are going to carry on starting a business or creating jobs, carry on paying the taxes that fund our schools and fund the NHS, then they need to know that the government is on their side. When we invest in the infrastructure our country desperately needs, it rec it's recognised on both as a cost but also as a benefit. And yes, adding to the government's debt but also adding to the government's assets. Excessive debt would risk everything the British people have worked so hard to achieve over the past decade of recovery. Who do you trust to protect that? If we're to stand any chance whatsoever of tackling climate change, if we're to stand any chance of providing a decent quality of life for all our people, yes, and also forever to bring our communities back together again. And we have to act now, and we have to act big, and we have to act decisively.